What's up YouTube land? Hope you guys are having a great day. I'm back in the game with another video and welcome back to my channel, NC Tough TV. So guys, you know the phrase, don't mess with Texas. Apparently, Jay Prince is singing that sentiment to these New York cats. Jay Prince is not here for the BS. He's here to get his respect. When you deal with someone in Jay Prince's camp and you disrespect them, on the level that those New York cats did, Jay Prince ain't trying to hear that. So in an Instagram post yesterday, Jay Prince went off and he responded to all those clowns that claim that he's dry snitching and also to the rappers that he tagged in a previous post trying to get them to find out what was the deal with those young boys who attacked YBN Almighty J, he was like, I don't need your help. But anyway, guys, I'm going to post what he said on Instagram and I'm going to read it to you all. And then we're going to break it down and assess this whole situation. So Jay Prince goes on to say, let me make myself clear. I was never asking any of y'all for your help in any capacity. I don't need you. I don't know you or trust any of y'all to do anything concerning the streets for me. With that being said, I witnessed the clown campaigning, bragging and snitching on himself on a public video about robbing industry people in your backyard. So I took it upon myself to alert the ones I have respect for. It is clear to me that went over some of y'all heads. Just for more clarity, I've been having ties in the Bronx and throughout New York for a long time. And now it's gotten even stronger with my youngsters. So don't give any of the people I tag credit for what others earn because they are all strangers to me other than music. All right. To all of you so-called gangster clowns, there's a time and a place for everything and I'm going to give you what you ask for. To all of you that's trying to narrow down my message to me wanting a chain back lacks the depth of the understanding that real street niggas have. That's why you are all squares. There's a movement taking place by the timid and the weak that wants to change the meaning of strong to weak and the meaning of weak to strong. My track record speaks for itself, so I won't lip wrestle with you punks. I notice a lot of young men on the East Coast that like to invite men to suck on their private parts, then call themselves gangsters, but real men don't invite other men to suck on their Peters unless they're gay. Then he goes on to say, I guess if the man you're asking to suck on you say, okay, you're going to get naked. Now that you know better, hopefully you punk ass niggas will do better. Or maybe it feels good being a punk ass nigga. Well, my Lord, what's going on, y'all? Man. So guys, as you can see, Jay Prince is not playing not one, not two, or three games with these cats. He's very serious about the situation that happened to YBN Almighty J. And he feels violated. He feels disrespected. And he's trying to communicate to these cats like, hey, man, things can get thick. Things can get very serious. Somebody need to talk to me. Somebody needs to rectify the situation. But, you know, New York cats, they're a different species. You know, their disrespect goes on another level. And they don't understand that the South, you know, we grimy too. And we can get with you. You know, we move in silence. We move in hospitality. But we're not going to sit here and let you just run over us like that. But anyway, guys, what you think about this whole situation? Do you think things are really about to get super serious with this J Prince situation versus the Bronx? Drop down in the comments and give me your thoughts and assessments. Also, if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share this video, and if you're new here, consider to subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to click that notification bell to be notified of when I go live 
or when I drop my next video. You guys stay up and be blessed. Go on.